Jack Lupino. Oh, again. Again, it's chapter 3, but we cannot see what the chapter is about because it's below my, my display. <laughs> uh, Lupino ran his racket of sex, drugs, and contract killings from a sleazy hotel in a slum block of tenements. The NYPD was closing in. I could hear the sirens. Their wail was a crescendo. Lupino thought he could get us by taking Alex out and leaving me to take the fall for it. All he had gotten was my attention. I went for the hotel first. It was a sad old thing with flickering lamps and faded colors cheap mobster punks and tired-eyed prostitutes. I walked straight in, playing at Bogart, like I'd done a hundred times before. The place was run by a couple of murdering mobsters with shark smiles. The Finito Brothers. Ladies and gentlemen, it's the pain in the butt. Painted a max. You're killing me. Did you make that up yourselves, or you get some wino downstairs to come up with it? Don't answer that. A rhetorical question. I got something for the boss. Lupino around? That kind of depends on who's asking. A friend or a junk squad plan? The don't answer. It's one of them, uh, how do you put it, uh, rhetorical questions. Lupino ain't here, but he said bye. Lupino uh -oh. wasn't in his cheap hotel. Instead, I ran into the Finito brothers. My cover had been blown. The door slammed shut behind me. And then I was dodging bullets on the raindrops. Pain to the max, haha. <laughs> Boom. <laughs> Finito brothers. Finito la comedia. <laughs> A letter on the desk caught my eye. I had met Lupino only once. The gangster ran all his rackets through his right-hand man, Vinny Gagnini. Gagnini was a high-strung whiner on the verge of breaking apart, like an overamped Energizer bunny. He had the brains to run the business, but he lacked the balls, always falling short, taking his frustration out on underage addicts and call girls. The V deal goes down at your hotel. Jack's exact words, quote, Vinny, you're in charge of this one, unquote. Rico Muerte is coming to see it through. Anything goes wrong and everybody's gonna get dead. It goes double for you. Treat this guy real good. Anything he wants, you give him. Don't screw this up or you're finito, finitos. A V deal meant added security, locked doors, and lots of nervous thugs with itchy trigger fingers. I'd seen nothing coming in, but that didn't mean it hadn't been there. Rico Muerte was a regular Kaiser Sosa, a spook story told to keep the apes in mind. 313. Finitos and scribble Muerte's room number on the notes margin. Wait for them. We gotta go in now. Horses, we're coming okay. in. There he is. Holy. What? What? <laughs> what happened? Jesus. Oh my god. I didn't save, of course. Come on. Oh, for sure. <laughs> Where is me? Oh, I was right behind him. A letter okay. on the desk caught my eye. Let's save right here. Nice. Okay, we've seen it already. I had met Lupino only once. I had met Lupino only once. A V deal meant added security, locked doors, and lots of nervous thugs with itchy trigger fingers. I'd seen nothing coming in, but that didn't mean it hadn't been there. Rico Muerte was a regular Kaiser Sosa, 
A spook story told to keep the apes in line. 313. The Finitos had scribbled Muerte's room number on the note's margin. Okay, but we can't wait for this thing. We gotta go in now. Bosses, we're coming in. There he is. No, ah! oh. okay. All right, boys. Damn it. How do I skip the cutscenes that I've already seen? <laughs> Getting out was not going to be easy. The staircase was locked and the elevator had been busted for a decade or mm. more. Mm, okay. Okay, dude, let's go. Ooh. What is it? Oh my, place for love. Holy. Brrr. Oh my. Wait, I was just here. Oh, okay. What's this? Nothing, okay, let's get out of here. Let's get out of here, through the roof, as always. As always, how else? with the bosses? Bane's there and they're not answering. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Hey, Helsink, thank you for, for the follow. I do recognize your name. Look at this. Look, look, look. Bam! <laughs> wow. Hey, hello, hello. How are you doing? I do, I do recognize your name. I think we've already seen each other on YouTube. Or, or somewhere else. Welcome in, though. have here old classic game yeah absolutely absolutely really good though I, I do love the narration and uh, I mean probably still plays really well uh, I do have a max pain free no I don't I don't I haven't played I don't think I played max pain 2 and 3 3 for sure not max pain 2 kind of don't remember Look at him. He's just chilling. Hello. No, you're not getting your pump action shotgun. <laughs> so. But yeah, I played this one in the childhood and I really liked it. So, but we have this little festival with different games at the moment, which I wanted to play for a while and community voted for them. Cool. Anything else? Ooh, maybe something more. Hmm. Yeah. So we voted a little bit for for some games and we played. And uh, this is the last game of the weekend, uh, but it was really fun. Really, really fun. Uh, really fun times. I enjoyed a lot. And uh, we, but we're still going with this one for sure. For quite a bit. Thank you, Lawrence. My lady. My lord. And now, mm -hmm. an old new episode of Lords and Ladies, brought to you in part by Acer Corporation. What is this? <laughs> Look at them. My lady. My lord. My lady, there is a matter of great importance I must bring to your attention. My lord, there is? Indeed, my lady, there is indeed. From the very first moment we met, Upon that distant forest path, there has been sunlight in the autumn leaves blazing. Do you, do you hear that? Oh, my lord, you should not speak so. But, my lady, I must, I must. My lord, no, I forbid you. This cannot be, this must not be. But why, my love, why? My lord, it is too dreadful. Do not force me to speak the words. My lady, I beg of you, I must know. I would rather die than not know. Yes, my lord, we should both be dead, for this shame is too my great lord. for the living. My lord, I am... My lord, I am your long-lost sister! <laughs> I'm 
bam <laughs> long lost sister and wow wow they love each other what else can you tell v head junkies could go off without a warning they had to be careful oh who the hell are you He doesn't look good. <laughs> right in the key, sir. Okay. All right, dude. I think it's a time to hit the save button. Okay, fire exit. Let's go. It's pain. Dude, you're cheating. You've seen me through the door. Okay. Hmm. Hop. What a scream. Yeah. Yeah, the guy, it's, it's one of the iconic screams for sure. No. Okay, this is where we came from. Yep. Okay. Let's not get lost. Also, again, another thing. This is just mind blowing that they have it in uh, this game. Bam! You shoot right into the uh, into the lock. I mean, I don't know. What else did have such uh, such things? Maybe Half Life One. Careful! It might kick back. Okay, that was my bad. Holy! Tell me. Ah. Tonight, the city's fight against the nightmare drug Valkyr took a turn for the worse, as DEA Special Agent Alex Balder was found brutally slain at the Roscoe Street subway station. We've seen a suspect it. was seen leaving the site only it's moments us. after the shots had been fired, and the NYPD is currently in pursuit of Max Payne, a repeated felon, felon, Max felon Payne. believed to be armed and extremely dangerous. And now the weather. The worst winter storm in recorded history continues to pound. Oh, that's where the vending machine was. Okay, I see now. Good. Dude, you don't look healthy. Not at all. Got me. Piece of crap. Okay. Save the game. I 
Where? Okay, look at his face. Okay, dude, this time we can leave. You scream too loud. Okay. The washing machine. Man. That's found Muerte's room. <laughs> what is this? That's Wait, what? Muerte's room. That's how Muerte's room. Muerte had received a letter. Damn. Did you see this trap? It's a trap. Oh. I think there is somebody behind us with a gun. <laughs> but we can read the letter. All tracks had ended with Jack Lupino. The letter in Muerte's room was signed by the Don himself. It was the first hint that the Kingpin knew what was brewing inside his syndicate. The trouble you got into after the Chicago screw-up. The Punchinello family bailed you out. You have been waiting for a chance to pay us back. One of our trusted boys has a monkey the size of King Kong on his back. And we need your special skills for backup on a major deal. Collecting evidence had gotten old a few hundred bullets back. I was already so far past the point of no return, I couldn't even remember what it looked like when I had passed it. That was not fair. Not fair to come from behind when I was reading the letter. Okay. Ooh. We have already that one though. Only has two bullets. That's really bad. Okay. Don't, don't come to me. Piece of crap, you junkie. I didn't want to kill you. You gave me no choice. Anything in the toilet? No. Right. Wow. Absolutely incredible. We can go up. I didn't want to know what had happened here. It was not a pretty sight. Holy, look at him. What does it say? Buff? And he's pierced with a wooden stick, like he's a vampire or something. That seems to be grenades. Oh, it's a Molotov cocktail. Damn. Painkillers. Is it like a sea? We found a secret. He needs a buff, yeah. I need healer. Damn. I think it's a secret, no? I think so. Wow. Ah, wait. <laughs> I thought I could go up. I don't. Uh, here was nowhere to go, was it? I don't think so. Ooh. Oof. N no, okay, I get glitches. Let me reload. Seems like if you play a little bit, it gets a bit uh, wonky, the place, the game. Ah. Hmm.
<laughs> what the hell? Anyone? I don't see where to go. I don't think I need to jump down. I think it's a dead, no? Cannot open the door. Hmm. gets old <clears throat> okay that's also closed the hooker had left her diary on the table what oh my look at this somebody was having here some fun oof Lots of VHS. Okay, who is old enough to, to use those? I guess everybody. Uh -huh. uh, okay, let's check the diary. What does she write? If the diary belonged to a hooker named Candy Dawn, the read would have made a vice cop blush. Had talks with the mystery hag over the phone again. Sent to the latest one-eyed Alfred tape. As long as the hag keeps paying for the tapes, the old man could come every day for all I care. She had a nice sideline, making secret X-rated flicks of her clients and selling them to the highest bidder. They would get her killed if her V-fix for the day didn't do it first. Okay, okay, so somebody was having their some fun for sure. All right. Bro, you shoot, you shoot me before I even seen you. Impossible. Now you see why I don't play any first person shooters. I hope you do. <laughs> okay, let's go down. Chapter four, the blood veins of New York. All right. The old service elevator rumbled down to the bowels of Jack Lupino's hotel. The washing machine is on. Holy, there's so many there. Oh, 
up here on the TV. A winter storm warning is in effect in the whole tri-state area as both freezing rain and heavy snowfall continue. Many roadways are already closed and people are advised to stay indoors. The severe blizzard has ravaged New York for three days now with no end in sight. We'd been snowed from the start in the Valkyrie case. The forecast said there was plenty more where that had come from. But the snowbound city was on my side. Less chance of innocent bystanders getting caught in the crossfire. True. Painkillers. Okay. <laughs> Absolutely amazing. Such a pro. Holy. Do we need to break all of them? Oh no. And what if there is something? <laughs> Maybe an extra painkiller? Or a bullet? Beretta ammo? Oh man. No. Okay. Baseball bat. Okay, somebody played baseball here. Exhibit number one, a newspaper. What is it? A dead man tied to a chair lay on the boiler room floor. Captain Baseball Bat Boy has an unbeatable track record in superhero death matches. <laughs> but a six pack of root beer gets me every time. The murder weapon was a baseball bat, now lying in a pool of drying blood next to a newspaper folded open on a Captain Baseball Bat Boy comic strip. Ooh. Now we can also play baseball. Cool, cool, cool. Who the hell are you? Take vampire. Why are they always set in LA or Mexico? They can't even get a tan. Okay, let me see. We need to go upstairs. Oh, wait. Okay, this. We have been here. What about here? Swings like a pro? Yeah. I played baseball. Down on the third base, damn. Okay, let's go. Fire extinguisher, what? <laughs> what? What is this stupidity? Oh my. Holy hell, I can't walk. Look at this realism. Damn. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, finally. Two, please. Give me more. 
Oh wow. <laughs> there is a natural power in here, for sure. This doesn't look like something that would happen to you. Or maybe he's trying to tell us anything. Maybe like, I need three beers, please. Hmm. Interesting. Okay. All employees should wash their hands before leaving toilet. Okay. Fair enough. That's the least you can ask for. Hello, gents. Damn. Oh boy. Oh boy. Look A at us. time ago, this would have gone down as a narcotics arrest. I need some more of those painkillers. There is a key on the table. Okay, bar key. Ooh. Damn, lots of money. The transparent cylinders glowed green, full of Valkyr. Okay. Let's open the closets. Yeah, thank you. Painkiller. Anybody played play painkiller? I'm pretty sure I did, but I remember almost nothing. A restaurant? A toilet? Okay. Good. More painkillers. Nice, dude. Finally, full health. Amazing. Uh... Two mad dog killers. Ready you to heard this great? Each other. They step into the next room. And I'm thinking, now they're gonna do it. <laughs> but no. They what do you think she's doing? They sit down in front of a TV and solve their differences your guess is in chat. Fighting video game. I tell you, Candy, I was so depressed, I strangled them both with the video game cables. Oh, Rico, you're so bad. I am, ain't I? Mm, mm. <laughs> Rico Muerte, big time hustler. Who the hell? It's that cop. Muerte went for his gun. What? <laughs> Rico Muerte. Okay, do I have anything a bit more... Uh... Nice. Okay, let's go. I think I do have actually painkiller. I believe so. Jeez. He has no pants on, dude. <laughs> he doesn't want to die. I have no pants and I don't want to die. Jeez. Look at us. Look what he did to us. We are all red. Jesus, 
Oh my god. It just looks so bad now. <laughs> he wanted to teabag after killing, that's why he didn't wear pants. Yeah, 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 exactly. The typical the typical situation, right? Where is she? Is that how you do it? <laughs> Those kids. Damn it. Ah, okay, do I have anything more suitable for this kind of shooting? Just... Okay. I think it's a safe. Ingram? Ooh, no, 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 but I don't want Ingram now. I think some of the hitboxes are a bit, a bit too big <laughs> from what I've seen just now. The antique switchboard was still in use. The what? Oh, that board? There was what an old find here? switchboard in the back room of the reception area, the kind that made phone tapping child's play. It wasn't hard to picture a fat pimp sweating with headphones on, listening to his hookers talk dirty and fake orgasms over a web of party lines, the blood veins of New York. Right now, there was a different set of moans and groans going on. Boss, I got you. This makes pain. A game started capitalist. He killed him. Was out a deadly virus released into the city's corrupt circulatory system something wicked this way comes max pain at large ever played condemned criminal origins now there was a game about beating up junkies no actually i didn't hear about that one i don't i don't think maybe if i like maybe if i've seen it Maybe I would remember, you know, like one of those. Uh... Wait, what? Hmm. Club. Ooh, we're going to the club. Okay. I don't really like it. Sometimes I I might not know the games that I played in the childhood, their names. Especially if they were like not something special. Wait, what does it say? <laughs> okay guys, write down the phone number 555 C. Okay. Everybody wrote it down. Just in case you feel lonely, Sunday afternoon, maybe Friday. Want a little bit of a Action. What the? Holy. Bam. Ooh, okay. Mm -hmm. Can we win today? What do you think? The same? Wait, is it possible to win here? I think it's all the same. I don't like it. So far, the least fought through part in this game. That you cannot win in a slot machine. Or maybe it's actually fought through and that's why you cannot win. Okay, painkillers, nice. 
It's a first person horror game, but most of the combat is melee and weapons break easily. It's not super old though. It wasn't free, 60 PS3, but can't accept it as a retro. Okay. True, it's kind of. It's in this weird situation where it's like already a game. Uh, like, it was big already, like super big at this point. But still not fully polished. Maybe not technology is not there. Hmm. Do you see anybody? Damn, the music came. Ooh. Condemned. I feel like I heard the name. But maybe again, maybe if I see it, I might Google it after. If I don't forget, I might have seen it. Lounge. Uba. Nothing here. Okay. Um, I was just here, wasn't I? So which way did I do? I need to go then. These pictures are not like yesterday in Katana Zero, Da Vinci, and Monet. No, 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 no. Wait. What? What is going on? Hmm. These pictures are real art? Yeah. Jesus, you can even press the freaking water bottle. Hmm. 